guys, Rich here from the RC Network, and I wanted to do a quick little comparison between the Tekken Pro 4 and the Tekken Pro 4 HD. Now, if you don't know, the, the main difference is the Pro 4 is a 540 sized can, and the Pro 4 HD is going to be a 550 sized can. Now, they will come in slightly different KV versions. Uh, the one on your right right here is a 4600 KV, and the one on the left is going to be a 4300 KV. Those are the fastest or the highest KV motors that they do offer in those two particular sizes. Now, they do come in an array of different KVs, and that would require different voltages depending on how low the KV will be. Now this one right here I believe comes all the way down in an 1850 kV, so it would definitely take a higher voltage to get your top end speed. Now let's go ahead and open up these two boxes. Uh, this one is obviously one that I've ran in my uh, low Z SCTE MIP conversion, and the one on the far left is going to be a brand new motor. So let's take a look at the two of them and let's compare the sizes and see if there's any differences. So uh, the first one right here, I have already used this motor. I've kind of been rebuilding my SCTE and I wanted to show you guys the differences. So right there, there's the Pro 4, 4600 kV, great motor. It is a censored motor, so it has a sensor port on the back. It has that huge five millimeter shaft on the front of it and you'll see there I have already soldered on that one before. Let's go ahead and set that one down and let's open up this guy. This is the HD, this is their new motor 550 sized and you'll see here a little bit longer can 4300 kV, it is a censored motor as well. Pro 4 that basically means it's a four pole motor and the sensor port in the back as well. So let's compare both of them side by side. We'll see if there's any differences. There's obviously a difference in the anodization of the end bells. The old Pro 4 has more of a pinkish one, I guess, and the other one's more orangish or reddish. I'm colorblind, so bear with me there. And let's see side by side here. And you'll see the length difference. It's just a little bit, probably three eighths of an inch. And then up on the front here. So let's look at quickly some sizes. I have my handy calipers here. Let's do the diameter first. And it looks like 36, we'll call it 35.99. The regular Pro 4, 36, same size as far as the width. And let's do the length now. This is going to be the Pro 4, so the 540 sized. And it looks to be 53, we'll call it. And the HD, or the 550 size. Sixty-three, so it gains about ten millimeters on the length of it. There we go. So there's the two comparisons. Someone had asked me for that, so I would definitely wanted to show you guys. If you have any questions about these motors or the RC network in general, please put it on down below. And as always, thumbs up and subscribe. That's it for now, guys. Over and out.